Hello all. In the previous video, we have seen about the introduction to the dental manpower, who is the dentist, various non-operating auxiliaries, and in operating auxiliaries, we have seen about the school dental nurse. In this video, we will see about the remaining part of the dental manpower. Next, we are going to see about the dental hygienist. The dental hygienist is not being a dentist or a medical practitioner, but performs oral prophylaxis, gives instructions in oral hygiene and preventive dentistry, assists the dental surgeon in the chair side. He works and manages the uh, dental office. Duration of the course is for two years. So his duties include oral prophylaxis, topical application of fluoride, sealants and other prophylactic solutions, screening of patients as individuals or in groups such as school children or in industrial employees, instructions regarding oral hygiene. So next we are going to see about expanded function dental auxiliaries, EFDA. So an EFDA is a dental assistant or a dental hygienist in some cases, receives training in duties related to the direct treatment of patient under the supervision of the dentist. So other names include expanded function dental assistant, expanded function dental hygienist, expanded function auxiliaries, techn technotherapist and expanded duty dental auxiliary. So the duties include placing and removing the rubber dams, condensing and carving amalgam restoration, uh, placing of acrylic restoration and so on. So next we are going to see about the frontier auxiliaries. Frontier auxiliaries are a community of nurses and former dental assistants who are provided training to work in rural areas where the, uh, where the public or private dental clinics are far. So they, are perform, uh, they perform simple dental procedures, dental health education, organizing fluoride rinses programs and uh, simple dental repair. So new auxiliary types. Expert Committee on Auxiliary Dental Personnel of World Health Organization in 1959 suggested two new types of dental auxiliaries. So dental licentiate and dental aid. First we'll see about dental licentiate. About dental licentiate. A dental licentiate is a semi-independent operator trained for two years and some of the important duties include dental prophylaxis, restoration of teeth and extraction under LA and drainage of abscess. So next we are going to see about dental aid. These persons perform elementary first aid procedures for the relief of pain which includes control of hemorrhage, extraction uh, under LA and recognition of dental diseases. They operate under the supervision of a salaried health organization. Their training period is about 4 to 6 months and followed by the period of field training. Dentistry involves the relationship between the dentist, dental auxiliaries and the patient. The essential thing is that effective dental treatment should be equally distributed with the well-qualified and dedicated dentists and the dental auxiliaries to the total population in the country. Thank you.